narrator goes on to say that if all the bees on the planet died, that the birds would be next, and then us. And my boy is like, we got to save the bees. <laughs> <laughs> that shit is real, that's real. <laughs> now that I think about it, I ain't see a bee all summer. <laughs> Now you informed. <laughs> now go inform the other brothers. Huh? <laughs> Take this with you. <laughs> then the narrator goes on to say, uh, the European bee is a much more kinder and gentler bee as opposed to the Africanized bee, which is a much more aggressive, hostile bee. <laughs> really? <laughs> Just gonna try to sneak racism into the bug world. <laughs> like European bees are floating around like. <laughs> so what are we going to do today? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Maybe we can pollinate these flowers. Like the African bees in his beehive, like, who are we? <laughs> <laughs> who are we going to sting today? <laughs> that is an unsuspecting white man out there. <laughs> <laughs> they want us to be killer bees, then killer bees we will be. I was talking to a comedian friend of mine recently, and he looked at me and he said, hey, why don't you have any jokes about your lazy eye? <laughs> and that's how I found out that I had <laughs> a lazy eye. I was like, I don't have a lazy eye. He was like, oh. Okay.